This short video is designed to show you how to track and plan mitigations once risks have been identified and submitted into Simple Risk. To plan a mitigation, we must first navigate to the Risk Management menu at the top and then to the Plan Mitigation panel on the left. In the Plan Mitigation panel, you will see all risks assigned to teams you are either a part of or otherwise have access to. In this view, you will see the risk ID associated with each risk along with their status, subject, and date submitted. This is also where you can see if any mitigation plans are already in place for a specific risk or if any management reviews have been performed. To submit a new mitigation plan, we will select the corresponding no in the row of the risk we wish to mitigate. Please note that once a mitigation plan has been assigned to a risk, the risk will no longer be listed in this panel. Once you click the No button, you will automatically be guided to the Mitigation Planning menu. This will allow you to map out how you plan to mitigate the risk. While you're in the Plan Mitigation panel, several input fields are displayed. The input fields with drop-downs contain preset values. These values can be changed by navigating to the Configure menu at the top, followed by the Add and Remove Values page on the left. All other input fields on this panel are only retained and displayed on a per-risk basis for each planned mitigation. You also have the option to upload any supporting documentation to your mitigation plan using the Choose File button at the bottom right. Once you've completed your proposed mitigation plan, you can save it by clicking the Save Mitigation button. After you've saved it, it is available for review by management or other key stakeholders. This concludes the video on how to plan mitigations. If any questions were left unanswered or you'd like to suggest any area where further clarification would be helpful, please contact us at the link on your screen.